Hi y'all, it's me. I'm back with entry number 46. Oh my gee, my Snow and Cocoa Challenge with giveaway. I'm still so excited to have so many lovely entries. I thank you all for taking the time to even consider entering my giveaway. Um, anyhow, really quickly, the video, original videos down below. It has all the information you need in the drop down box. I have three other videos that show additional prizes that have been added, as well as the extension date, which is October 17th. I need to have all entries in my hands on that date. I cannot postpone this any longer. I'm sure everybody who's submitted early on is anxiously waiting, so please get those entries into me by then. And I also have a playlist on my channel if you'd care to check that out. So the next entry that I have to share with you comes from Alondra and that's Alondra's um, IG information so you can find her there and I did have to try to open this a little bit to see if she has a card visible but she didn't so I didn't want to go further but I know who she is anyway so <laughs> let me look at how cute these are oh my gosh Alondra you colored these I bet oh my gosh how cute hold on there's more I won't get them all out Look at how cute these are. Wait, there's a bunch in here. She's got all these little cute images that I think she colored. And hold on, because there's I'm not getting snowballs on my floor today. I just don't want to clean. <laughs> I'm shaking it a bit, Alondra. Sorry, I have to see what's coming out. Um, look how cute. There's a tag here that says December. There's um another one right here, a little gingy, a snowflake. Um, here, let me get that one. A bow, cute bow, a candy cane. It's right there, and then there's some snowflakes down in there, and it looks like the holly. And these are adorable. Thank you so much, Alondra. I don't color, but I'm trying to learn. Christian showed us, but you know how that goes. Anyhow, these are her little images that she submitted as part of her confetti in her box. And then this is her little entry here. And hold on, because the dingle balls are flying everywhere. And <laughs> I, I, I'm, I'm tired today, y'all. I went to a wedding yesterday. I don't feel like picking up dingle balls. <laughs> okay, um, okay, so here's, she has the fiber from um, Dollar Tree that we all have. So that's going to be reused. So I'll put that there. In fact, I'm going to put her little box right over here. And then let's see what she's got going in here. Oh, there's the dingle balls. Oh, so cute. Sorry, hold on a minute. Let me move this over. Over over there and pick up the dingle balls. Oh, see? They're, they got static. They just go where they want. Look at how cute. Alondra, this is so cute. It has an embossed let it snow. That's beautiful. On there, and then she has some um, ephemera that she colored. There's little snowflakes around. She did with a little punch. I think I have that punch. And then she did a bow with a poinsettia behind it that was um, from die cuts, perhaps. And it's in this little booklet here that she created, which is tied with this pretty pink ribbon. So let's see what comes out of here. Oh my gosh, how cute is this? Ah, uh, Alondra, this is so cute. Okay, hold on. Don't peek. <laughs> I want to be, look at it together. So this is, um, let's see, what is this? Does this come out? Hold on. It might. I don't want to pull on it, but this looks to be like a journaling pocket. And look at how cute she stitched the cards onto the black cardstock. And it's funny, but Snow and Cocoa looks so beautiful with black in the background. I really like that. Thank you so much. And look at how cute this one is sewn as well. And then there's that little pocket. Oh, sorry. There's. I'll bring it up close in a second. There's a little pocket right there. And she's got her colored images. And then she has a snowflake and some sequins on there. And the little winters of wonders of winter, and then she stitched that as well. So that's adorable. And then inside were these other little tags and whatnot that can be journaled on or used throughout whatever I do with these when I do it. So I'm gonna stick those in there. Thank you. That is adorable. And then on this one is two 
of entries right here and look at their beautiful little snowflakes and she's got her colored images a tree and you stitched holy cow you know i i admire y'all that can stitch that tiny stuff because yeah just not happening at my house <laughs> but look at how beautiful they are she's got um sequins and little snowflakes and her coloring and then the the words here and it's so cute in this cute little book and then on the next, oh, look at how cute. These are, oh, those are so pretty. These are some nice rosettes, and they're they're actually made out of cardstock, not crepe paper, which is so beautiful. And it has these images that have glitter on them. The little tree there, the little starburst or what that is there. Then she made these little tags with little wire-wrapped heart dangles. So cute, and a little pearl eyelet and then she raised up these little elements right here with the words oops sorry and then there's the one at the bottom so cute it's got snowflakes and the trees and the bird and wow impressive and then this one is also another wire wrapped beads um, a little square one and a little round one and then the cute little images, and she stitched on these tags, by the way, in the background there. I don't know if you could see with gold. Those are so adorable, Alondra. Thank you so much. And then this is her third set of entries, and oh, look at how pretty. Now, see, you can do tons of layering without making them chunky, and they look just as gorgeous to me, too. I love them. So here she's got double stars where she's done some stitching. She's got um these tiny little... Um, snowflake with a little um what you call those oh lord i can't think today uh, enamel dots in the middle there's sequins there's gold leaves from the trim i believe um there's some sparkly leaves here and some of these are really beautiful i love this die cut wherever it came from it's beautiful and then that pretty bird and then here's another one here double layered another one of the snowflakes with the enamel dot and a tiny little star you can barely see but it's right there and then she stitched on the star as well and then again layered that beautiful die cutting um, of the leaf and vine or whatever that is there with the gold leaf trim and oh there's the oh she did four thank you Alondra woohoo so this is the second um journaling pocket how cute so there again i love that bear look at how cute that is this is a great pocket a great journaling spot thank you so much um let me pull these out so we can look at this together and this one has the second pocket that she stitched she did stitch that tag as well um she stitched around that can you believe <laughs> wow <laughs> yeah okay you're good <laughs> and she added all these cute little things that's a darling stocking a little ticket the house she sewed here she sewed here got a little snowflake and then in the pocket she has the snowflake she has two journaling spots this one right here which is so cute and then she has this one here with the little car on it super cute those are definitely can use those and then the last item is the snowman which i love so thank you so much alondra this is such a cute little entry i really love it all i th thank you for taking the time i wish you tons of good luck into my challenge giveaway i know that you had two entries so i have your two tickets right here so we can feed the swan and here we go that's number one so cute can't wait to play with everything I'm going to start playing with it all as soon as this challenge is done. I just don't have the time at the moment. But that's number two. There you go, Alondra. Thank you, honey, for entering. Thank you for taking the time. Good luck in my challenge giveaway. Thank you all so much for watching. And until next time, do what makes you happy. Bye for now.